Outrage today in North Idaho after hateful symbols were etched into property of a Coeur d'Alene High School. Vandals traced a swastika near the Lake City High School football field last month. Because of the nature of the chemicals, the symbol didn't appear until just recently. Jack Ferris working for you with the details. Once they realized what was here on the side of the Lake City High School football field, it didn't take long for school officials to get rid of the swastika. But now they're asking a lot of questions. We find it sad and extremely disappointing that someone would choose to leave that sort of a mark on school property. Due to the ongoing investigation, Coeur Public Schools were careful with the kind of information they disclosed on the crime. We're told the vandalism occurred in early June, right around graduation. The chemicals used to carve out the swastika and other obscene symbols burn the grass slowly. The hateful emblem wasn't visible until just recently. The small incline just in front of the home stands of the football field have been marked before. It's been involved in what could be described as a prank war with rival high schools. This mark, however, is unprecedented. That's hatred. Hatreds, there's no excuse for hatred. We're in North Idaho. We want to be tolerant. We want to love our neighbors. It's, it's, no, it's not okay. For any age. <laughs> If it was parent-driven, it's even worse, but no, it's not okay. Coeur d'Alene police were unavailable to comment on the crime, and Coeur d'Alene Public Schools maintain they're doing everything they can to help in the investigation. Additionally, we are working to review our internal reporting and communication practices regarding incidents like this. Reporting from Lake City High School, Jack Ferris, KXOI 4 News.